we end up in the nether realm <laughs> with a very pixelated looking 2D sprite of a Dark Knight of Vanda, whatever the heck that is. Here is the super boss of Super Mario RPG. Culex. And he has some very familiar battle music. So Culex has four crystals. Fire, water, earth, and wind crystals. And so he has five attacks every round, and they are incredibly powerful attacks. So we're going to start the fight out by using up these red essence. What this does is it'll make us invincible for some number of turns, and then hopefully in those turns... While we're invincible, we can destroy enough of these crystals to bring the fight to down to a manageable level. That's the plan. So I don't have to actually dodge or do anything, because nothing he can do can touch me right now, thanks to the red essence. But this is where we've been saving up some of our attack items and things for. The crystals have different hit point totals, and I'm trying to try to focus on bringing the lowest one down first, if I can. Which I think is the green one. But we'd be long dead by now. Uh, okay, so Gino, you're going to go ahead and use a Power Blast on everybody. When the Red Essence wears off, we're going to use the Defense Blast. So here we go. Um, we're going to go Psych Bomb with her. Let's see what kind of damage I'm doing to this Green Crystal. Not a lot, but everything else took a little bit of damage. You can get more red essences. In Nimbus Land, there's an inn you can stay in, and sometimes when you stay at the inn, uh, you have a dream of Toad, and sometimes Toad... Or you have a, like, a weird dream, and then after the dream, Toad gives you a red essence. So you can kind of farm them if you really want to. Even though the green crystal is not taking a lot of damage from Sight Bomb, I think I'm going to stick with Sight Bomb here in order to try and maximize damage on all the other crystals. We just get to watch all of the fun battle animations play out. And then on Mario's turn, we'll start in with the Lazy Shell attacks. And hopefully some crystals are close to dead. Miss! Excellent! That's what we want to see, for sure. Oh, that was a waste of a turn. That was grotesque. That's just a shame. Every wasted turn is mortifying in this fight. <laughs> Okay, Red Essence is still up. Let's go in with Geno Flash now. Is that Geno Flash what I want to do? I guess. This is Geno's strongest ability. The sun blinks. Deal some damage. The question is, do I still have Red Essence for one more turn? I guess for now I do. I don't know why that didn't actually hurt him. Now I'm worried. Maybe the Wind Crystal you need to use magic on. Alright, so Red Essence is gone, so now I've got to increase defense. I wasted two turns with Mario learning that Wind Crystal. Shenanigan. Oh, I don't have a Psych Bomb anymore. Okay, uh... Then I've got to use a Syrup. And now we're going to start taking damage. 
Not a lot of damage because... Uh, do I go Ultra Flame or Ultra Jump? Let's try Ultra Jump. Oh, that's right. Ultra Jump is multi-target. Okay, the green crystal popped. The blue crystal just has a spell called Crystal, and it missed. Alright, cool graphic effect, Square. Stop showing off. Ooh, that was big damage! Things are not looking good. So, okay, what I need to do is... When I inevitably lose this fight... <laughs> I need Mario to be ultra-jumping. And kill that green... Crystal a little earlier. Should I Psych Bomb here? Maybe I should Psych Bomb here and I can use it to pick me up on Gino. The blue crystal is the one that's got to go next. So we're going to try Ultra Jump again. As we kill crystals, it becomes more and more likely we'll win the fight because we have to endure fewer and fewer attacks. Down to the point where it's just Culex, we should have this in the bag. I'd like to see Gino miraculously survive to Peach's next turn. Mmm, with Water Blast, not looking like it. Alright, so Culex attacked. Nice. So we did survive it. Uh, we've got... This is going to eat up half of my flips. And then I think Peach is going to have to group hug here. I don't know how many flips Ultra Jump takes. But yeah, Peach has to group hug here. Get everybody back up. So, well, I, we're probably going to sustain a bunch of damage, so it looks like on Geno's next turn we're going to Caro Caro Cola. I probably could have invested in a few of those, actually. That blue crystal's still alive. I don't like the looks of it. I suspect, actually, that Culex's Shredder move that he used removes my buffs, my Geno Boost stuff. Mario's taking very little damage here because of the... Lazy Shell. The Lazy Shell just reduces damage by a lot. But it makes your attacks much weaker as well. Okay, so it's time for you to use... We don't really need a Cola here. We do need to fill up our flips. Can I Lazy Shell the blue guy? No. You need special attacks for the crystals, I suppose. We're gonna lose Gino here, probably. Yeah, that's gonna do it. Peach is afraid now. Alright, this is a bad round to be in. I Do I come back or do I use... I use a pick-me-up here, right? Yeah. To preserve the flips. Very good. Then on her next turn, we'll group hug. I'm actually weathering the crystal storms a little better than I thought I would. Okay, there's the blue crystal dead. That was just an insane amount of damage. Let's just be honest. That was just way too much damage right there. An attack from Culex. It's hard to dodge his just regular physical attack because he doesn't have any animation. He's a Final Fantasy villain. He just doesn't move at all. Uh, okay. We can safely Psych Bomb here, I think. The next crystal to die is, I think, the yellow one. And we'll just keep Ultra Jumping until we get him down.
but the lazy shell armor is really what's helping us out here. Oh, the yellow one takes no damage from jumps. I don't want to use flame attacks, though, because the red one's still alive. This, I think, is the big damage one you gotta worry about. Oh, we made it. I can safely flash here and then group hug. I'd much rather Psych Bomb here. Should I Psych Bomb here and then... Caro Caro Cola, I wonder? No, I'm gonna group hug. On Mario's turn, let's throw a Lazy Shell at Culex, then. Yeah, he doesn't like that damage. Ugh, goodbye. I think Shred so Shredder's a free round. I think our buffs are long gone right now, anyway. Uh, let's use... I can't use Psych Bomb here. Let's go ahead and just use Come Back then, so we can save the pick-me-up. Very good. And now, pop another Kira Kira Cola. How many of you- I got three more! Three more, then I'm tapped. But if you're gonna use them, this is the fight you're gonna use them on. Why is the Earth Crystal using Water Blasts? Alright, back to Geno Flash. So Geno Flash and Psych Bomb and then Lazy Shell on Mario is going to be where we're going to do our damage from. So even with the wasted rounds early in the fight, I think we might actually pull this out. As long as we don't run our Kara Kara Cola's out. Goodbye, Peach. I should actually save my pick-me-ups for if Peach dies, because she can revive and nobody else can. Like getting these Psych Bombs out, though. I wonder if Mute would work in this fight. I don't think I've ever tried it. I don't think I've ever cast Mute in this game, but she does have a Mute spell, which should silence enemies. God, you know what? I'm gonna go Super Jump against the Red Crystal. <laughs> that was a mistake. I was not expecting Mario to be the weak link in the party in this fight, I'm gonna be honest. That was a lot of damage. Oh, this is gonna get ugly. Oh, he gave me a free round, so she can safely group hug. Excellent. Uh, not with that few flips, though. Here, eat a syrup. Okay, got a free syrup. Let's group hug. That was a rebuilding round. We were just setting it all up. God, Mario, what can you safely do here? Just attack QX, I guess. Yeah, our buffs are long gone. Sorry about the jump cut. Some incredibly rude people knocked on my door. At least they were wearing masks. I have killed them and buried them in the backyard, and their families are now very sad. Uh, we use comeback here. To try to get Gino up. <laughs> this is the, uh... The dangers of recording during the day. During a Saturday, I guess. Do I need an Able Juice on Princess Peach here? I 
Attacking Culex, I really need to attack the crystals, but Mario just doesn't have anything that's good against the crystals, is the problem here. I probably should have given the Lazy Shell armor to Peach then, instead of Mario. Anybody can equip it, is the nice thing about this. <clears throat> Peach is not going to get another turn, she's probably going to die here. Is there anything I can do to make her not die? I don't think so. I can try to put this on again. <clears throat> and then see if she can last till next round when she can group hug. No freebie on that? Alright, fine. It's not looking good. Oh, if Culex attacks Mario here. Yes! That's what we want to see. Beautiful. And we got the defense up buff from that. So, now we can flash. Oh, you know what I should do? Should I use up my last power blast here? Not this round. I should have Mario use it and then hope it doesn't get Shreddered away. I'm pretty sure that's what Shredder does, because it doesn't ever deal damage. Like, it doesn't even pop up a zero, which means it must be doing something, and my guess is that it erases buffs. Uh, you need to group Hug, which will heal us back up and clear your fear. And then you, let's try the Power Blast. And then hopefully... Nice. I don't know when you're supposed to push the button to get the perfect defense against Mega Drain, but... It's, oh! My two damage dealers are both afraid, and we got shredded. So, that round... That was, what, four frog coins wasted? <laughs> um, I'm gonna Geno boost. No, I'm not. I'm gonna put some damage out there, even though it's gonna be reduced because of fear. I still think... We still need to get this red and yellow crystal quick. Get out of here. I can't believe they're still alive. Um, I'm gonna Psych Bomb and then Caro Caro Cola, and I'm gonna see if the Caro Caro Cola removes status ailments. We've only got one left, though. So if this doesn't do it... Actually, I don't need health, I just need... You know what, we're gonna Syrup and save the Cola for when we need to heal with, uh, Mario. Oh, nice, free, free Syrup. I want this hit Mario. Mario! Mario! Gino. Ooh, that was gonna be a kill no matter what happened. Uh, okay, you can come back on Gino. <sighs> I feel like we're just treading water. It's a little ironic because the water crystal is dead. So Gino's back up and running. Mario can't damage anything here with this shell. All he can do is super jump the red crystal. I, I can group up. I'm going to have to group up with Peach next round. I'm thinking, do I want to use an Able Juice on Peach? But I don't think I want to. I think we should try super jumping the red crystal. Since the yellow one doesn't take any damage. This is not a bad super jump. I mean, it's only 48 damage, but it's better than you can do with a Lazy Shell. That's not good. Oh, I'm only got one more pick me up. I think this is gonna end in a loss. Oh my goodness. This is very, very bad. This is a this is bad news bears for everybody right here. Alright. Oh, we got the free pick me up. That's very, very lucky. But Peach is gonna die here again. And this time... <laughs> well, okay. Mario's still in pretty good shape here, so we'll just pretend like that round didn't happen, and we'll try to pick... This is our last pick-me-up if we don't get a freebie, though. Thank you. No freebie. So if it makes it back to Mario and Peach is still alive, we're gonna go with it. Aha! Aha! <laughs> God! Just when something good happened. Um, 
So, what does that mean for us? We can't heal anymore. We got two colas to heal with, but... <laughs> I just... <laughs> oh, this fight is a comedy of errors. Yeah, that yellow crystal can't do anything else to us because we've dragged this fight on for so long. All right, let's just throw shells at Culex until... <laughs> Ideally, what would happen is in the early part of the fight, we would get like a freebie on our rock candy. And we'd get to use two rock candies would be really nice. But because Mario doesn't have a way to do this... All right, so <clears throat> what are we changing then? We're going to give the lazy shell armor to Peach. Because she's the one we really need to survive. And start out with Ultra Jump on Mario. Do as much damage to the green and blue crystal as we can. You can see the Lazy Shell armor, how much work it's doing for us here. It's kind of amazing. It's in the next dungeon we get our next equipment set. I wonder if we should wait to get that set to try Culex again. <clears throat> I'm just so immune to all kinds of damage. You can't hit me with fire, bro. You can't do it. So we definitely want the Lazy Shell on Peach. She's the one that can revive without having to use a pick me up. We did get lucky with one pick me up but I just I need you guys there we go what you don't need FP to use sandstorm I mean it's just one damage but <laughs> even if I kill Culex I don't have any way to kill the two. Oh, that's not true I might be able to actually pull this out all right I might as well I might as well make the effort, right? Like I might as well. Since they can't really do any damage to me, I might as well try super jumping. Let's actually ultra jump, because that'll damage QX as well. I can't boost, I can't revive, I can't do jump damage to the yellow crystal. Red crystal's gone. Yellow crystal has a hard time attacking. And I get killed. Okay. <laughs> I think it's clear that I just need a small change in strategy here. So what we're going to do... Move this over to... Peach? Uh... I'm going to do this, because Peach's rounds more often have to be spent healing, and Gino's the one that wants the attack boosts. Alright, I think I'm happy with that. The only other thing I can do is buy more pick-me-ups or carrier caracolas. Let's try Culex one more time. We got him this time, though. I know to go in with Ultra Jump. This does mean we're going to see reduced damage on Psych Bomb, though. Alright. <laughs> Let's have a whole video where I fight Culex for 20 minutes and die, and then fight him for 20 more minutes and die again. That's kind of how Culex goes, though. Alright, we're going to start out with the Red Essences. I had a bracer too, so I could have given. That's very fortuitous. All right. I like what's happening here now because that means we got a free red essence that we can put on probably Peach. So next we're gonna do power up, and then 
we'll, if we get a freebie on our rock candy, because that's like 300 damage to everything in the fight. That would be excellent. Oh, freebie red essence. I think we're gonna put that on Peach. Because Peach dying is where we spend our pick-me-ups. Gino, if you don't mind, if you would power blast us, please. So Ultra Jump or Ultra Flame here. Or do I want to... Let's see what his attack does without the Lazy Shell Armor. Okay, so it's a lot better. The Lazy Shell Armor is what's reducing his attack. So what is Psych Bomb going to do here? Because now she's got the Lazy Shell Armor, so her attack's going to be down. Almost nothing to the green crystal. Oh, that's terrible. Well. It could be that the lazy shell is a liability. And... You really just want to come in and do as much damage as possible. Oh, I forgot to use my rock candy. That's what we can do. Three hundo on the rock candy. I'm gonna stick with Psych Bomb just because it was doing well over a hundred to the other crystals. Well, it didn't that time. Oh, because he got... Well, Shredder shouldn't have hit us. It's got to be that lazy shell, which is just a reduction in damage across the board. It's got to be what's happening here. Whoever wears that, their damage output just tanks. Can't damage us, bruh. Can't do it. And then I've got a fire rock after this that I can use, which I think one or two of the crystals won't care about, but the rest should take damage from it. Yeah, that green crystal took max damage from it, which is nice. I wonder if Geno Boost stacks with a power blast. I don't think I've ever tested that. Oh, we do need a syrup here. Get that freebie. No freebie. That's the attack there that's big, big damage when it connects. So I got no crystals dead from these three. Oh, I do have the extra red essence, though, which is nice. All right, that's it for... Red Essence. Unless I get another freebie from Peach here. How lucky would I have to be to get a freebie Red Essence on Peach's turn? Let's try Ultra Flame. I doubt the red crystal will take anything from that. That was really good, actually, against the blue crystal, and it's the next one to die, so... Alright, guys. Cross your fingers. Here we go. No freebie. Ow! Oh, it's not, they're not going to target Peach with anything now. Look at this. Well, we've got the Red Essence. We can build this back up. We have three free rounds to fix this problem. Uh, come back on... I'm going to say Mario. I think he's a little hardier than Gino. Okay. 
Well, please hit Peach. Why? Oh, uh, why you do me like this? Come back, Mario, please, before this red essence wears off. I think the Lazy Shell really reduces how much healing she's doing with those spells, too. Because in the previous fight, they were coming back for, with quite a bit. They're not hitting Peach with anything. <laughs> I'm gonna waste this whole red essence. Alright, let's try one more time here. Come on! Lazy Shell might just be a liability in this fight. The longevity of it is fine, but whoever's wearing it can't be killed easily, but they also can't deal damage. No, that's how I got the, the trigger on. So Mario might survive this round. I'm just bad at triggers, I guess. But he just can't survive all these attacks at once. It's just not in the cards. Well, okay. Let's reset this then. Let's come back in with no lazy shell. Maximum damage on all three characters. Oh, you know what? I, I do want to test something else too. Hold on. I do have an idea. First of all. No lazy shell, it's just... Oh, you don't want a sailor shirt? You want the fuzzy shirt? Oh, you didn't even have your best armor on that time. No wonder you died so easily. Uh, I think I still want these setups here. No, I want this. Yes, I want this. Because this is damage boost and this is damage boost. One more thing I can actually try out here. Does Geno Boost stack with a Power Blast? If it does, because it should be a 50% boost on top of a 50% boost. And if we do that on somebody and then have them use the Rock Candy, we should get 450 damage out of it instead of 300. Let's see if that is in the cards. Keep bragging, QX. Oh, give me that freebie essence, man. Come on, one freebie essence. That'd be so lit. Alright, no freebie essence, but... It's fine. We'll just sit through all of your animations again. So the plan is have Geno boosts on Peach with a power blast. So you're going to use the power blast. You're going to use Geno boost on Peach. Alright, and then Mario, we know, should Ultra Flame. And then let's see how much damage we get from this Rock Candy on Peach's next turn. Ooh, this is a new attack. That's a beam? That's like a bubble. That's a light, weird rainbow bubble. This didn't stack, or if Shredder... There's no way Shredder can work through Red Essence. That would just be mean. Still got 300 out of that. So I guess it doesn't stack with Geno Boost. I guess if you have the attack up trait from one buff, getting it from another buff doesn't make it 50% on top of the 50%. So 
we'll go back in with Ultra Flame here. We might take out that blue crystal first, my goodness. You can't see, but I'm making a face right now. One more round of Red Essence. Uh, let me think here. So Gino's gonna have to use... No, I can do this. I can use the Fire Bomb. Nice. Actually, that's nice. That's really good. I can have you use Gino Flash. And then Mario can drink a syrup. And then Peach's next round, I can use another Firebomb. Yeah, that's the plan. So we have seven, that's not enough to do anything good with. So yeah, drink a syrup. Delicious. Another round of animations. At least they pulled the battle music out of the correct Final Fantasy game of the era. If you're gonna have to sit and listen to battle music for hours on end. That should do it for Red Essence. We should be out now. We are. Alright, so let's Firebomb now. Oh, that was gorgeous. Alright. Red Essence took out two crystals. What's the plan for Mario here? Because Jump won't hit the yellow crystal... Flame won't hit the red one. I think I'm going to go with Jump, because that will damage the red crystal. And, or actually, do I want to use him using item here? Yeah, we want to get defense up. That's what we want. So I'll him use this. Got a freebie. You like to see it. So we get half damage from these attacks, which is lovely. And I'm going to have him do the same thing this round, because I'm still assuming that Shredder destroys our buffs. So Psych Bomb and Geno Flash here. Which is full damage against all crystals. They should just call that attack the Derpy Sun. The, the Derpy Sun. That's what I think they should call it. Defense up again. Got a freebie! Woohoo! This is looking good. This is looking pretty good. This is probably going to kill whoever it hits. But our, that means our defense up buff is still on. So I'm going to come back, Gino. Welcome back, Gino. Ugh, that was not a lot of healing, though. Uh, we can Gino Flash. Oh, and then Mario can Caro Caro Caller. He doesn't need to increase our defense again, because this is going to tap our flip reserves. So this actually timed out pretty good for us, all things considered. Yeah, we're out of flips now, and we need two big heals, and we still have our defense from last round. So, we can do this. So yeah, all things considered, if Gino had to die, that would... Oh, but he lost his defense buff because of death. Culex, you Shredder. Not perfect, but okay, we're going to group hug here to get everything back. Um... We'll Gino Flash, and then we'll use that Bracer, because only Gino needs defense. Only Gino died there. 
and save the crystalline for next time it uses Shredder. If I'd have known Shredder was going to be involved, I would have made a terrible Ninja Turtles joke. But I already didn't do that. Except spoilers, I just kind of did. Hell yeah, buddy. Alright, Gino should survive this round now, unless he gets Dark Starred again. I'd rather actually see Gino get Dark Starred, maybe, than no, because I'd rather use Psych Bomb. Okay, so there's Shredder. So we get our full attack this round. Oh, maybe I should group hug and Geno Flash. Yeah, I'm gonna be safe. Group hug Geno Flash. This is not time to use another cola just yet. Come on, Derp Son. Big damage. Woo! We are getting pretty big damage out of it. And this is should be our last crystalline. No freebie. Nice half damage from the Mega Drain. We might have to group hug again here, depending on who Qlex hits. Uh, maybe if this does not hit Geno. Okay. Uh, how many flips do we have? So I think what we're going to do here is... is oh, we, we can use a Kara Kara Cola, but we don't have enough to do this and Geno Flash. We may end up doing the lower level Geno spell after Psych Bomb, and then Mario can use a Cola. I think that's the plan here. Oh no, we have just enough for Geno Flash. This worked out perfectly. We've got to be close to move, moving our next Crystal on out of here. We've got to be getting there. We have to be getting there. Okay. I wish it left your... Like, UI on screen up in the top left corner. It's not like it's in the way of anything. I just would like to see how many hit points I have in between rounds. That wasn't terrible. I think I do still need the group hug here. And eventually, Geno Flash is going to take care of these other crystals. There's one. Uh, so Ultra Jump should actually be pretty good now, because I've only got two targets, it won't waste any jumps on the yellow crystal. Or I could use this last Power Blast, although will lose its effect if he uses Shredder. So I think I am going to Ultra Jump here. Not bad. Single target attack, I like it. If Qlex hits not Geno. Okay, so that is the end of... So here's what we're going to do this round. I don't need to heal, do I? No, I'm pretty good. So I'm going to have her use the Power Blast, because this won't get interrupted. Then we're going to Geno Flash. And then we're going to Ultra Jump. And that way, if I get Shredder this round, at least I got two boosted attacks off. And then after this, it doesn't matter how often we get Shredder, because I don't have any more ways to apply buffs. So we still have our attack up. Excellent. It is time for Group Hug, and then I think we can just set in with regular attacks from here. No more crystals. He really should be shreddering us now. Because I can just do this every round. I'm just going to... No, you know, I'm going to keep group hugging. Well, yeah. that That's... That's a full heal like every round. And from here, we have this in the bag. Whew! Whew! 
Alright, no more attack. Oh. Uh, I could Geno boost, I guess. I'm gonna have you... Because we're gonna need some f more flips eventually. Oh, we had one more of these, too. Well, we don't need it now. And that's Culex. Is there a better use of the Final Fantasy victory music than defeating Culex in Mario RPG? I think we earned the hell out of this fanfare. Uh, it's looking like magic attack for Mario, but I don't know that I want to give him any more magic attack. Because we're not really going to be using his jumps or flames at this point. I think I'm just going to go attack with him from now on. Unless the hit points are just outrageous. It's f plus five hit points on her. Her magic attack is actually useful because Psych Bomb is... Really good. Oh, Bowser got a new thing we'll never see. And after Battle 2 and the fanfare, we are treated to the prelude. It's one of my favorite video game songs of all time, is the Final Fantasy Prelude. It just a, really doesn't get better than that. Shoutouts to Kai for sponsoring this video. If you liked the video and you want to see more, please tickle my thumb, leave a friendly comment, and ring my little bell.